Hello and welcome to Nikolai's Genetics Lessons and today's video is going to help you to convert numbers usually when we work in the laboratory we work with extremely small numbers which we usually have to convert from one scale to another one and here's a problem which of the following is not equivalent of 10 micrometers and what is a micro? Micro means one millionth of something. So one divided by one million. One, one, two, three, one, two, three. So one millionth. But we have 10 here, 10 micrometers. So we put zero here and we can cancel this zero here in numerator and zero in denominator. So 10 micrometers actually equals to one divided by, we have five zeros here, so by 100,000, so of the meter. So 10 micrometers is 100,000 of the meter. Now let's convert all these measurements also into meters. In order to get, for example, here, one centimeter, we have to multiply this number by 10,000. In other words, we have to move this decimal point one, two, three, four places to the right. So we have to multiply by 10,000. So in order to get one centimeter. But we have to convert this number into meters. So we have also to multiply by 100 because there are 100 centimeters in a meter. So basically uh, this number here equals to one divided, let's count how many zeros we have here. We have four zeros here and two zeros here. So one divided by one, one, two, three, one, two, three. So uh, one millionth of the meter. This number is one millionth of the meter. And we are looking for uh, those numbers which are not equivalent of 10 micrometers. And this one is not equivalent. But let's check other numbers as well. Where and B is given in millimeters. So we have to multiply this number by 100 or move this decimal point two places to the right to get one millimeter. So if we multiply by 100, we are going to get one millimeter. There are 10 millimeters in one centimeter and 100 centimeters in a meter. So we have to multiply one millimeter by one thousand in order to get a meter. So basically that means that here this number means one divided by, let's count how many zeros, two zeros here and three zeros here. One divided by one hundred thousand. And as you see, that means that this number here is equivalent of this number. So let's put meters here. We are not going to circle this answer because we are looking for those numbers which are not equivalent of 10 micrometers. And we see that this uh, number here is equivalent of 10 micrometers. Let's check where and C. We have here 10,000 nanometers. What is nanometer? Or well, what is nano means? Nano means one billionth of something. In this case, one billionth of a meter. So uh, that means that one divided by billion. So one, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. And we have 10,000. So let's put four zeros in numerator 
and now we can cancel four zeros in numerator and four zeros in denominator. So as you see, this equals to one divided by 100,000. So of the meter. And that means that 10,000 nanometers equals to 10 micrometers. Again, we are not going to circle this answer because we are looking for those which are not equivalent. And now let's check where NT, 100,000 angstroms. So what is the angstrom? Angstrom is one power minus 10, or it is one divided by 10 billion. So one, zero, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. One divided by 10 billions. So let's also add this five zeros in nominator. One, two, one, two, three. And now let's cancel them. Five zeros here and five zeros here. So this number is equal to one divided by one. And how many zeros we have here? One, two, three, four, five. So one divided by one, two, three, four, five, by 100,000 of a meter. Again, as you see, this number is the same as we have here and equals to 10 micrometers. So as you see, the only number which is not equivalent to 10 micrometers is going to be this number, which equals to one micrometer and all the rest equals to 10 micrometers. And this is all for today. Subscribe and see you in the next video. Goodbye.